It's the Cornerman Radio Live with Barzini and Boxing 9. Jose Ramirez versus Maurice Hooker. What's your take on this unification, WBC and the WBO champion unification fight, man? What do you take on this fight? I like this fight, man. Uh, you know, I watched the Hooker fight. I was up in uh, New Hampshire at a cheerleading event. We had to travel over there for my daughter, watch it with a bunch of people at a hotel in the lobby. And uh, it was a good fight, man. Hooker, he a rangy, you know, lanky, powerful type of fighter like that. You know what I mean? Vernon Forrest. Um, but I, I said to you after I watched it, I, I'm like, I looked and I said, oh, I think Ramirez is going to be able to get inside. Ramirez is a little more of a dog than the other dude that he fought, Sosedo. Like, Ramirez is a real dog. But you can't count Hooker out, though, because Ramirez is a tough style for Hooker. But um, I believe it's it's a good it's a good ass fight though. It's a good fight, man. You know, Hooker likes to be, you know, play possum and shit on the ropes, and uh, who knows, man. You know, Ramirez. You know, he's a good good condition type of fighter. So, uh, he sh- Ramirez is tough, man. He, from to me, it's probably gonna be in his backyard. Um. Like I said, man, you don't really – you got good stamina. You might be a little too much on the inside for Hooker. But Hooker can, you know, push him off, get some distance, and land some of them lanky-ass shots like one-two. He, he rips the hook. Um, shit, he's got enough pop to fucking, you know, right button, press that right button on Ramirez. It should be interesting. It could be interesting. But uh interested to hear what you got to say about that. Man, Mauricio Hooker proved me wrong twice, man. He went to Terry Flanagan hometown and defeated him and just beat him. I didn't think he – I thought it was like a seven-round five. I gave the edge to uh, Maurice Hooker. I think he edged two more rounds than Flanagan. Then he proved me wrong against the Sacido fight. He went to um, Sacido, Alex's hometown in Oklahoma, and on ESPN, on Bob, Bob Aram's network, who is Bob Aram's fighter, Sacido. Yo, and Maurice Hooker beat him. Fucking beat him. Like, knocked him out. Where where I thought Sacido was winning the the first half, and then... Maurice Hooker just came back with vengeance, and he proved me wrong twice, man. Like, this dude is, like, I'm 0 for 2 with Maurice Hooker on predictions, man. Like, I keep thinking these guys going to beat Maurice Hooker, and they come out short, you know. And Maurice Hooker is showing that he is getting better and better every fight. You can't, you can't uh, underestimate him. But this time around, I'm betting against you again, Maurice Hooker. It's no, and this is not like I got anything against Maurice Hooker. I just believe that there's guys that I think can beat him. You know what I'm saying? But I got proven wrong twice. But third, you ain't going ain't gonna be no strikeout with me. You're not gonna beat no Jose Ramirez. I'm sorry. You know what I mean? You're going to have to make a believe out of me, man. Like, if you beat Jose Ramirez, I will never doubt you again, Maurice Hooker. I I, I probably got to interview you one day and think, because we got to talk about how I've been 0 for 2 with you. But I'm coming, I'm coming, man. I'm coming when this third. Yo, do you know the, do you know the reach difference? I just looked that up real quick. Mm-hmm. Hooker got an 80 inch reach. Ramirez wow. got a 72 inch reach. 72. Wow. If that's correct on Wikipedia, it's not always 100 percent accurate. But we all know he's got a reach anyway, so yeah. that's going to be interesting. But <laughs> I can tell everybody this: this will be 
the best fight on ESPN, bro. Hook and oh, I'm looking Harris, forward to it. This is fireworks all over. This is a war. This is something you need to tune in for. I'm not playing. This is explosive. This is amazing. This is the one of the gr- greatest back and forth fight you will possibly see. And just the way these two guys it's a, this is fight. the championship of the World Boxing Super Series. It's going to yeah. be. And it's the two champions that's out of the World Boxing Series. So it's going to be great, man. We probably might get to see an undisputed 140 champion again, man. I think that's what they need to do to keep – Keep bringing it in, man, because these lower divisions, like 140, nobody's really, the casuals and a, a lot of people are not really so excited for. But we, them, these guys fighting each other is going to get people excited for. So I can't wait to see Hooker and um, Ramirez. But Ramirez, I just believe Ramirez will get the win. If Hooker makes a um, win this fight, you know, I'm going to salute him. I, I'm going to congratulate him because he proved me wrong three times. But it won't be three times. It only going to be did, two times. Who did Ramirez just his, his toughest it fight? Did. Oh, Mayor Mom. But, yo, this one's going to be – yeah, Orozco, too, was a good one. But th- those are two good wins. But uh, Hooker's going to be his hardest fight. 